touring scenic spots in Kwangai. And Mountain and Tra River are the iconic spots of Kwangai's numerous beautiful landscapes. Discovery Vietnam this week will take you on a tour of these landmarks. Tra Hoc, also known as Tra Giang River, is a long river and also a popular destination for tourists to Quang Gai Province. The river runs from Dok Tran Mountain in Khan Tum Province, 2,350 meters above sea level. The 150 kilometers river passes around mountains and slopes reaching Quang Gai City to create a peaceful and imposing landscape in the city. Van Gogh though is a tourist from Hanoi, I only intended to visit THR beautiful beaches in Quang Gai but I'm also very impressed with the beauty of Tra River. The section that passes the city is very peaceful with coconut ranges on both sides and pure air. It's really relaxing. Thien and Mountain is also must see in Quang Gai province. The 106 meters mountain looks like a seal if seen from afar. That's it is called Neem and Thien Ha or Heaven Seal. On the top is Thien and Pagoda built in 1695. The pagoda still retains a magic bell cast in 1845 by artisans of Modak Bronze Casting Village. The path up the mountain in the south is spiral light, but not too steep and can be accessible by car and motorbike. From there visitors can take in a panoramic view of Quang Gai City. Thien and Pagoda's architecture is as simple as that of Ruang House whose structures are made of wood and fixed with bolts and mortises. The main worshipping hall is in the center and the halls behind are dedicated to worshipping ancestral monks. The pagoda is surrounded with gardens of ornamental trees and to the east it are tomb towers of the monks. A well called Buddha well has remained intact since the pagoda was built. Monk Thich Dong Hong is head of the Thien and Pagoda, during those early days, our ancestral monks dug a well but after a while, they could not get water. The older monk went up and took a rest and when he came back, he saw the well full of water but could not find the younger monk, who dug the well with him. That younger monk was said to be a genie that came to help dig the well. Though the well is on the mountain, it has never been dried. The locals believe that water in the well can help cure a number of diseases. The pagoda attracts a lot of tourists and pilgrims during holidays and major occasions.